in the upper right corner of the armrest, you have the button to activate the hydraulics. Navigation in the display is done with these arrows, up, right, down and left. The navigation is confirmed with the OK button and to return to the previous screen, simply press the Escape. Escape is also used for correcting any mistakes. Now switch on the hydraulics and let's see what we can find inside the settings. First, turn on the ignition and press Escape. Here you will see the tree menu structure. First up is the general view, dual view and hydraulic settings. Arrow down to level 2. U-Pilot Headland Management to the left and Tractor Settings to the right. Down again to level 3. On the left are units for measurement like litre, celsius and metres. To the right you have the performance data for tractor and implement like fuel consumption or hectares worked. On the fourth and last screen to the left you have the tractor information, VIN number and wiring series. Located to the right is a new square where certain machine functions can be analysed by service personnel. The bottom of the screen will also show all the malfunction codes for the tractor use, so four screens in total.